The block of mass m is travelling with a constant velocity v along the table. It has several forces acting upon it, its weight acting downwards, a normal reaction force upwards from the table, a force f pulling it along, and a frictional force f little f acting in the opposite direction. The size of this frictional force is given by the coefficient of friction times by the size of the normal reaction force. And from Newton's second law, the total of all the forces acting upon the block is equal to its mass times by its acceleration, which in this case is equal to zero because it's travelling at a constant velocity. This means that the vertical forces must balance out, and so must the horizontal forces to give an overall force of zero.